Keep in mind that if you eat out, a single restaurant meal can easily exceed the entire daily allowance. Burgers, fries, and drink combination may actually contain 3,000 milligrams or more of sodium. One meal has already exceeded your entire day's worth of salt. It's really important to remember Sodium can hide in all sorts of places. It can be in processed foods, in canned foods, in condiments, in preserved meats. So when you're reading labels, aim for foods that are less than 140 milligrams of sodium per serving. And be careful of all of those hidden sources, processed meats, canned soups and vegetables, frozen meals, breads, baked goods, cheese and dairy products, sauces, dressing, and condiments. And if you're thinking about, well, okay, what are some practical strategies I can start using? Use herbs, spices, lemon juice, vinegar. All of these can be used instead of salt. Rinsing canned vegetables and beans so that you can wash away any excess salt in there. Of course, cooking from scratch is one of the best things you can do to control your sodium content. But keep in mind, you want to gradually lower your salt so that your taste buds adapt and don't feel that shock of abruptly stopping something.